and then it wants May at 4,000, which feels ridiculously early. It's been released. It's, it was released over an hour ago. Uh, right, Q and H one zero two nine. Uh, this this thing is just awful. I'm, like, I I I don't. I just don't trust this thing. I just. I'm not worried if we don't hit four thousand at Mayfield. We've not got any ATC. There she is. What's released? The new origami scenery for uh, London Gatwick, which is what we're flying into now. Gatwick traffic, Tomjet 3, Echo Lima overhead, Mayfield for the ILS 08 right with approximately 40 miles to run. It's not going to be that long, is it? Zebo is not working. Yeah, I mean, I'm on a very old version of the Zebo, but this, the, I'm stuck on this same version of the Zebo for ages because it's been working fine for me. Four thousand at May is far too low anyway. I just went off what the chart said. Mayfield at four thousand. the hell is going on in the background of that guy's um, house. Hey John! I'm watching on my iPad. Oh sorry, I didn't even realise that. I've got the counter strike on and just have it on for the scores in the background. Move it out of the way so it's not a distraction. Yeah, I just have it on for the scores. Right, I mean, I guess we should do the full thing, shouldn't we, really? I don't know what it's looking like. I'm going to just check what it's like on traffic to wonder whether we should try and m move in like a little bit earlier, but at the same time, I don't know. I wish we had ATC. Oh, we're good. I've got loads of room. Or have we? Oh, wait, no, there's a DHK and an EZ inbound ahead of me. What is DHK? What airline is that? Okay, all right. It looks like we'll be doing the full arrival because we've got two ahead of us. And one of them is uh, rather... Thousand ago. Checked. Um, close to the other. DHL. Oh, it's Air UK, is it? Oh, I see. I see. I see. All right, well, I... Traffic in it is. I'm going for a two turn in we're in no rush how long have we been airborne an hour and eight minutes like yeah we're in no rush we'll just carry on quite leisurely we're, we're low but who cares william the kid have a look on my youtube channel i released a video all about it just a few weeks ago Is that ortho for XP? No, it's Orbex True Earth Great Britain. Which is payware, but amazing. There's the scenery! North terminal looks pretty busy. Looks all right, though. There's an easy jet rotating. That looks so cool. Mike is leaving the hold pattern and the downwind leg for runway 02. It is busy. It looks borderline real. I miss Gatwick so much. Oh, I forgot. I haven't shown you what arrived today. 
I put it on my Twitter. You guys probably can't read it, but it's a piece of fuselage from GV Big, which is the uh, first 747 that I flew on. So very bittersweet. But yeah, it's an actual piece of the aircraft. Aerotiques do it. Right, I'll take that one. So yeah, very bittersweet. Brought back some lovely memories. But actually being able to travel and everything like that. And obviously on a 7-4 as well. So yeah, a bit, bit, bit of sweet. But was it expensive? No, not really. I think it was about 15 quid, which might sound expensive for an aircraft tag, but I don't really care. Got a mate who has the FO's yoke. Oh, I'm jealous. <laughs> Green dot. I think I think it's still flying. Right. Let me just check what my spacing is with the traffic. What? Oh, I don't know what this DHK is doing. Uh, DHK three seven. What are your intentions? Flying in cross the land, I won't be doing cross the land, I'm afraid. I've just gone back to the flat one bug here, like nice and early, because I don't want to overshoot the turn really. Plus. Might want to take some flaps in just so that the nose doesn't rise too high. Yeah, I tell you what, let's take flap five now just because the nose is going to really start to pick up on us soon. There we go, localizer swung around now, so I'll arm it. Yeah, we've already checked out the scenery on Tuesday's stream. We were very lucky enough to have a pre release copy, which was great. And this thing's awesome. Right. This DHK guy isn't giving his intentions or anything, so s screw him. I'll switch over the tower. miles or so, cool, good. I love these views. There we go, view our lock. Uh, wrong one. Uh, north terminal for Tui, if I remember correctly. One's for to the left, is it? Oh, yeah, there it is. There's the 747. With its nav lights on by the looks of it. Yeah, I've turned off the snow drift. Right, guys, I'm going to pause the alert to arrival. Sounds very quiet, doesn't it? Cool. Currently 4,000 feet above, shouldn't affect. So that's great. Right, one, two, four, two, two, five. Cool. 10 miles. I can't see anything for the traffic ahead. There's the easy, like on TCAS, anyway. Oh, there Channel we go. Short uh, in June 7 on my right. Two, two, three. Runner 205, hello, hold you at 7. Hold you at 7, uh, runner 205. Right, right, we're established, we'll call out. Oh, hello, Tomjet 3, Echo Lima, fully established, RLS 08, right? Right, no, it's a question, Tomjet 3, Echo Lima, Gag Tower, continue number 2, right to number 2, surface soon, 07014. Continue number 2, Tomjet 3, Echo Lima. 070 degrees at 14. I don't know what my component on top should be on our V-Ref. I'll just YOLO it. 2500. Jet. Right, we'll pause the alerts. There we go, done. Come on, you with me. Yeah, that's it. 
Why is that ATC so loud? 313 on behind the landing, Gizzy Jet Airbus 325, Jet at 1, line up, runway 08 right to behind. Get down, Flex 15. On 60 to 4, we'll go. VREF plus 7, Roger. Lovely day in Gatwick, isn't it? Beautiful day. Considering it's like freezing cold outside, it's stunning. Absolutely beautiful day. Who said the XP11 can't look good? And if I turn reshade off, is there snow in England? There has been a bit, yeah. Right, 2,000 for the go around. I'm actually half expecting it here because there's a guy who's just not vacating. Okay. Now, I haven't landed this thing for a while, so this could be interesting. Wish me luck. I'm flying a very old version of the Zebo. Oh, we've got we should have loads of room. Yeah, that's fine. I don't know why he's not rolling. Top jet 3, I can hear Good Richard, good evening. EZ367 on... Is he rolling or not? Juliet, for Juliet 4. Stand by, break, Tom jet 3, call him on. Loads of room. 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 I thought he wasn't rolling for ages then. Be good. Right. I hope I don't smash this landing. Wish me luck. Well, that worked out nicely, didn't it? Loads of room. Get a bus through there, as Mama Chewie would say. 300. Approaching minimums. Departure. Minimums. Cute. Someone's hooked. One three on. Uh, one three. Runway seems very thick. Okay. Fifty. Forty. Thirty. Twenty. Ten. Well, I'll take it. Speed breaks up. This is normal. Contact ground one two one decimal eight. Tom Jet eight three Echo Lima. Thanks. There we go. An hour and eighteen minutes later. Welcome down to Gatwick. We made it. The new Origami Scenery Studios. There's a Jet Blue here. Is about to run into an Easy Jet. <laughs> What's going on there? They're having a fight. Who's going first? Look at that. Wow. I'm glad we caught that. That was quite funny. Uh, right, where the hell did I vacate? Continue, we're across there now, so they're good to go. Grand hello, Tom Jet 3 Echo Lima vacated on Charlie. Tom Jet 3 Echo 
Charlie Short Juliet, Tom Jet 3 Echo Lima. Juliet is here. Is the AK to contact tower 124 decimal 225 by Cool! Well, there we go, everyone. Welcome down. I'll unpause the alerts. We'll see. Uh, we'll see what routing we get given. We want to go on the north terminal. So we'll see what we get given. Juliet, Quebec, Alpha, and just confirm 564 for Tomjet 3 Echo Lima. Tomjet 3 Echo Lima, excellent. 564. Sure, 564 is there. So we are turning on to uh, Juliet, and then Quebec, and then Quebec Alpha. Lovely! Pretty easy, should be no problem. Don't forget the probe. There we go, everyone. That was good fun, wasn't it? I hope you enjoyed that arrival. We are going to fly out of here. If you guys would like to stick around, obviously very much appreciated. Lovely to have as many of you here as possible on a Friday afternoon. This is the final stream of the week. Had a bit of a rough week this week. I've been a, an ill man. So, uh, it's good to have some, uh, some good vibe. Good to have some good vibes. Good and good. Is the scenery heavy on FPS? You can see my FPS in the bottom, uh, left-hand corner there. It's absolutely fine for me. I love this scenery. We've already checked it out once this week, and this is the, uh, the, the release candidate version now. Sorry, I had a release candidate, but it's now we've got the uh, the full um, shebang. We've got the version 100, which is what everybody else has got. I do use True Earth GB, yeah. We doing the return? If you guys would like to see the return, yes. I would quite like to do the return. Tower on 124, that's what teach you five, bye bye. All the deliveries. And obviously we've got the closed off A380 stand there. What's that? Lots of easy jets. I have a feeling there's a lot of people flying Tollis. That's a plane. Really? <laughs> wow. Very good. So, uh, I didn't talk about it earlier, but just to try to convince some of you lovely people to stick around, the, uh, the glide slope into Chambry is a four and a half degree glide. With terrain everywhere, it's also snowing, and it was last seen overcast at 1,000 feet. Oh, and if that wasn't enough, um, the last time that we were there, the winds were favoring the opposite runway. So we would be landing with about a 12 knot tailwind. So a four and a half degree glide, terrain everywhere, snow, low visibility, and potentially a 12 knot tailwind. So if you guys would like to see that approach, stick around, because that's where we're going to be flying to in the return flight. Do the circling. I don't think we're going to be able to with the Viz. The Hunger Games makes me sad, Becca. I want feel-good films right now. <laughs> Five, six, four. Isn't the tailwind limit ten knots? I don't know what the tailwind limit is in this thing, but we'll we'll find out. Uh, is it six nine 
Well, Becca, I mean, in comparison, I watched Charlie in the Cho or Willy the old one, Willy Wonka in the Chocolate Factory last night. So, you know, that's the kind of thing that I'm in right now. I mean, we're certainly going to give the arrival a go, even if I don't uh, nail it. You know, we're certainly going to give it a go. We'll go all the way, shall we? To the end. Oh, I miss Gatwick so much. I miss flying. Right, that'll loop. Parking brake is set. APU's good. Two blue, one red. Engines are dead. And I'll just switch Unicom for now, just so that things are chill. There we go, an hour and 37 minutes block time. Not bad, I'll take it. Um, so we'll do a Ryanair. And actually, they leave all their fuel pumps on, so I'm going to do that. Do they even stay pressurised? I think they do, don't they? Wait, no, do they... Do Ryan and leave the elec pumps on? Hydraulic pumps on? I can't remember. They do, don't they? That's not what I wanted. Right. Okay. Um, now, have I got a Sam Jetway going to connect? Or not? Is it going to work? Oh, I was in thingy mode. I wonder if I disconnect and redo my parking brake whether it will connect. Oh, it looks like Sam's not working for me. It was working the other day here. Sam I find very temperamental as an add-on. Very temperamental. Can you show your in-game settings? They're all on my website William the Kid. About 99% of the questions I think you've asked today are on my website my dude. Chewy94.co.uk. That will help you out. Just click the manual and auto mode a few times and then it will auto. It doesn't seem to want to. No. Correct, Benny, correct. Alright, well, no jetway then. Poor passengers. Gonna have to use the, uh, the stairs. Um, right, okay. I think we're good. There we are then. So, if you've not seen it before, this is it. The new Origami Gatwick scenery, which released today. About an hour and a half ago now, I think. Um, really lovely scenery. Yeah, we've already checked this out on Tuesday, so this is the second time I'm checking it out. God, look at the stream of departures. Very nice.